Hey everybody, XCI here. Welcome back to a blind let's play of Witcher 2 Enhanced Edition. Here we have Geralt, we have Vess, and we have Vernon Roche over there. And I think we're about to uh, have to sneak through camp to get to the uh, to hands out. So uh, before we move on, I want to talk to Vess and see if she has anything you to say. She probably has. You say nothing, Vess? You have nothing to say? Just standing around, just helping out, but doing okay. Fine. Let's move Vernon on. Waiting. Come on, Vernon. Let's go. Let's see how painful this is going to be. Uh, again, if I have an option of fighting through camp, I'm going to do it. Uh, reach Hansel's tent with Roach's... Oh, with Ro oh, he's going to cause a dra dis distraction, right? That's what he said. Whatever the hell that means. So, Vernon, how close do I have to be to you? Like, what do I do here? Oh, no, that's me going into stealth mode. And Geralt, there's... hide. I will. While I steal their shit. Just hey, you! Do... Come over here! What do you want, Tamarian? I hope I'm doing something right. I, I hit where I thought I had to. to me, Grunts, oh, shit. I'll make mince meat of your arse! I, I can't jump over the. I'm stuck. To me, Grunts, I'm stuck. Alert. Can I, can I, uh, slip? Oh! No, it's just when you get caught, you get caught. Okay. <laughs> Good thing I saved. Okay, because otherwise I'm like, I don't know. I'll fight my way through here. <laughs> no. I don't think so. So don't waste your time looting. And don't go right. Uh, unless that I, that I, maybe I, that I pop my head out. Geralt, hide. Okay, I'll go this way, maybe. Hey, you, come over here. What do nope. you want, to There's marry? There's me to go here. Those so, Nilfgaardians guardians are beating up our lads. Do I just what? like? Our sons will regret that. Like, how do I know I'm hidden? So I just stay here in the bush. Just don't move. Oh. Oh. All right. Well. Uh, am I allowed to loot though, or is looting the break? Do I need to loot though? Oh shit, there's that guy right there. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's. Well, I'm gonna check. Just it's early enough where. <laughs> Sneak through the camp and take all their shit, Geralt. Anyone here? Anyone here? No? I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe I'm doing this. It's not the time, Geralt. <laughs> shh, shh, it'll work out. Got two guys over there. Are they coming back? Take it, take it, take it and go, take it and go. Um, right there, I don't know. Do I stay in the shadows? I don't know how to get around this though. How close can I get to these bastards? Use. Uh, that feels like I'm gonna get caught. That doesn't feel right at all. And if I cross straight through here, I have a feeling... Okay, well, let's see. Wow, you suck. Are they all sleeping? Steal it all, Geralt. Come on, man. Take and go, take and go. Cut and run. Anyone in here? I'm risking it. I'm risking it. <laughs> You're gonna lose all your shit. Monster, up. yeah. Take it, take it, take it. Okay, don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. You don't need that side. Okay, this isn't that bad. Is it maybe more difficult on hard? Like they get, they have more range of sight or something. Oh, I'm gonna save it because this is gone, going really good here, and I want to know what this is too. Okay. <gasps> Why am I out of stealth mode? Hey, dummy. Okay. I'm a... Hey, hey, dummy. <laughs> taking a risk, taking a risk. Um, the gates. Oh, they're like dozing off sort of thing. So, I don't know. Guess aimed. Oh. Oh, I have to get into that tent. Shit. Do I just fight him? Do 
Can I get around? Hmm. Is there a sign like where they might be falling asleep or something? Here, hold on. Let me see if I can get. Nope. Right there. Like the guy looks like he's dozing off, or is he just checking something? Okay, hold on. Let me check this side over here again. Didn't I check this side? Wow. I'm like right in front of this guy's face. See if there's like an open behind the tent or something is what I'm thinking. I think I could have run for like this side. Yeah. Okay. So it wasn't. So I could have done this. Okay. I have to distract them somehow. Oh. Okay. You know what I'm gonna do? Just really quickly read here, just in case there's like a hint or something. Uh, it wasn't part of the camp. Really contained an en uh, re really contained an entrance. Really. Contain entrance to the cave that. Oh, okay. The Witcher managed to enter the Kabani camp, and since he was already there, he decided to sneak into Hensel's tent and get the raw blood he needed to cure Saskia, a plan worthy of a vampire. But Geralt was no bloodsucker, though he killed many. Our hero decided he needed the services of an ace spy and asked Vernon Roach for help. That does not tell me something. Assassin of Kings. And uh, Harpy's Nest. I learned an employer. Geralt was still trying to find the Kingslayers, but two of them were already dead. Only Letho, the craftiest and most dangerous of the three, remained alive, and it was him that Geralt wanted to find most of all. Okay. I have to find a distraction. I have to find a distraction. What does that even mean? Can I put something on fire? Oh. Oh, cast art sign. Mm -hmm. And then bounce? Wait a minute. Can I just... Wait, what's up? What's this sign here? Hold on. No, it's like inside the tent, maybe. Okay, so we're going to go here. Um, I don't know which side they're going to go from, so let's save it. Ooh. Oh shit. Hello? What the devil happened here? Hanselt will skin us alive. Put that shit away. Geralt, put the Um I, I don't know how to get the blade put the blade away, so who cares? It worked. Let's go. Who are you? Yes. Have you come to kill me? I'm here for your blood. You sneak in here like a villain and you want my blood? Fight me and try to spill it. Calm down, your highness. I need only a drop. I like how he's still respectful. Who are you? He just... Pure neutral, man. Oh. I am. Geralt of Rivia. I was say it straight Voltet's up. Voltet's favorite witcher. I've heard of you. Why do you need my blood? You know, I'm just gonna... Should I? Oh... I would know that this is a bad idea. Yeah, but I feel like I'm just Saskia, gonna the Virgin of Edirne, was poisoned. Royal Not, blood. I mean, I know why I'm doing it, but I want to know what he'll what say. What superstitious this. nonsense! The wench wants royal blood. She should bite Stennis Edens air in the arse. Listen, your highness. <laughs> Tried to give me your route. blood voluntarily, or I'll open your veins myself. I prefer the first choice. Him, I guess, it would work but... out better for both of us. If I, I spill know, I your blood myself, I'll have to break through the entire camp again. Who knows, maybe one of your soldiers will get lucky and kill me. I sincerely hope so, Satchel Mouth. But then the Wraith's Mist will hang on the border until your knights become weary of warring. What are you talking about? You know how to open the way for my army? Yes, but I can't do it dead. You'll get my blood. But promise you'll disperse the mist. I like that. Yeah, my word, King. Because at the end of the day, in my head, I was like, Geralt's just neutral. He doesn't care what people's reasons are for things. Like, they can, I could just, if he doesn't agree, I'll kill him and then take the blood, right? But I'm going to try to be neutral and say, look, this is this is why it needs to happen. Um, I'm glad that the story actually made it turn around. Like, this guy's 
at the end of the day, he needs the same thing. He needs that thing to go down, and then he'll go out to town, or wherever the hell he wants to do with it. Witcher don't care. I just want Triss back. <laughs> that's Remember, how, that's my I'll approach right now to this, to to this particular run. Camp. I wouldn't want one of the soldiers to get lucky. Tell me, though. You don't, though. How did you pass the mist? I'm a witcher. Then I need an army of plowing witches. Why would you want <laughs> witcher farmers? No, I'm just joking. Just, I can't. I can't unhear that now. Oh, cool. So they teleport me out. That saves me a lot of time. And boom. <laughs> that was simple. Oh, why do I still feel like I'm in the dangerous? Where is Tris? Why do I still feel like I'm in dangerous territory? Here's the music. Panic me. Where is Tris Marigold? Ding, 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 ding. All the way down. Keeping their multinational empire in check required much craftiness from the Black Ones. And Schillard Fitz Osterlern was known as one of the craftiest Nilfgaardians for a reason. While looking for Triss, Geralt fell into a trap the emissary set. But that was only the beginning. Geralt spat all elixirs out when he learned that he found a compressed Triss some time ago and carried her in the form of a figurine on his person through the whole time. The sorcerer's turned item changed hands and Fitz Osterlin took her to Loch Muin. Oh boy. Act 3 we go. Geralt was furious and Philippa Alhart was now in deep trouble. Then we have Geralt ruled that the version of Adern should decide Stennis's fate. Of course, the peasants will be read that. Stennis was captured and led away underground. Geralt had only one source of royal blood remaining. Hands up. Yeah, so that's good. We're almost there. We're almost there. Uh, oh, while we're, while we're at it. Let's see what this one says. The Song of the Hunt. Tracing an ever wider spiral, the hunt circles the world of mortals. Everything decays in the centrifugal vortex. Pure anarchy rages over the world. The winds of war swell on blood, flooding the rise, uh, the rights of ancient innocence. The best lose all hope, and the worst revel in fervent and fitful power. Looking glass images without heart or mind haunt the worlds in the name of those who have preserved blood for, from blood. And, f and feed on unrestrained lust. Hmm. And before I move it on here, let's go here. Camp's followers' encampment. Camp followers' encampment? Hmm. The inevitable hodgepodge of camp followers had settled in just above, just beyond the palisade of Henzelt's military camp. The area was home to all manner of rabble, such as craftsmen, prostitutes, traders, thieves, and vagabonds. In other words, all those needed to keep an army on its feet. Vernon Roach was directed to settle with his soldiers among the camp followers. This instruction from the Kedwanis was meant as a jab at the Temerians, but the Blue Stripes honestly preferred the company of scoundrels to the to that of warriors bearing the unicorn on their on their chests. Good Wendy camp. The great any military camp greeted us from afar with the cacophony of sounds typical of such encampments. Officers, commands, and sentries shouts mixed with the growling of platoon leaders enlightening uh, enlisted men as their mother's professions and why these ladies charge so little for their services. Veterans cursed, recruits sniveled, Horse giggled, horses neighed, and dogs barked. The din was accompanied by a jumble of smells, the stench of several thousand men who consider guard duty in the rain to be an adequate bath cannot be mistaken for any other, and this blended with the scents of boiling cabbage, foot wraps, and stables. Compared to the nauseous odor of winds of the wind carried from the camp latrines on sunny days, the smell of the Karen Slayer seemed like that of a flowering meadow. Oh, the trolls would love this place. And we have any of the Van Vanimar. Schillard Fitz Osterlin's personal sorcerer had only just made Geralt's acquaintance when he died at the witcher's hands. Triss Marigold. Look at you, Triss. Look at you. Triss had reached Adern. There was evidence to prove it. Okay, in Adern, the search for Triss ended with a discovery of a bitter truth transformed into a nephrite figurine. She had ironically 
being in the possession of an oblivious Geralt for a, for a time, and he had brought her straight to the Nilfgaardian's camp. The Nilfgaardian emissary envisioned a special part for her in Loch Moine. Vernon Roach. Roach not only provided him with valuable... Oh, Vernon's help was not as unexpected as it was invaluable. Even though Geralt stood with his opponents, Roach helped the Witcher, saving him from certain death. Furthermore, he did so out of kindness, thus proving that tales of his callousness are somewhat exaggerated. Roach not only provided him with valuable information, but also risked his neck, helping him to acquire raw blood. Though Geralt had not sided with him fully uh, earlier, Vernon trusted that the Witcher would be able to get to, Fla to full test murderer though that meeting was to be their last at least in this story Geralt never forgot the debt he owed the Billy Stripes captain yeah I'm working on it and Schillard oops not that again many northern kings appear in this story rash and thoughtful amorous and frigid brave and cowardly the reader should easily see that should their crowns be removed and a pitchfork sword and a bunch of bills or a goat's apple given in a scepter's stead they would be as human as we are. The same, however, could not be said of the Emperor of Nilfgaard, the white flame dancing on the barrows of his enemies, whose shadow fell over all the events I written down. In this case, that shadow was represented by Schillard Fitz Osterlin, a consummate diplomat who started more than one war only to end it accepting homage, uh, homage from the defeated. The meeting with Schillard during Geralt's visit to the camp was not as friendly as the previous ones. It turns out it turned out that Schillard's gambit saw the Witcher as a pawn blocking the way to Triss Marigold. Schillard intended to use her in his political intrigues, and since Geralt had become an inconvenience, the envoy ordered him killed without a second thought. Then he headed to Log Win. Sirit. Sometimes a person's name sinks into memory and brings fear to one's heart. At its first mention, who was the mysterious Sirit? What goals drove him and what role would he play? Geralt had yet to learn all of this. Sirit was probably one of the witchers Roach had mentioned. He and Ox trying to cover Letho's escape while Sheila located their hideout. Though both died in the end, they completed the task buying the last Kingslayer time to flee. I wonder if that's something you experienced in the other play, the other run, the other side of this. Ox. When he first heard Ox's name, the Witcher had no idea who this was. Ha! He did not have the slightest inkling of the role this individual would play in our story. Ox was probably one of the Witcher's Roach, Witcher's Roach had mentioned. He and Sprit were trying to cover Letho's escape, blah, 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 time to flee. And then we have Henselt. Henselt's virility had okay. Uh, Henselt accepted the unthinkable. He shed some of his raw blood for a stranger. Anything was acceptable if it further the pursuit of his long of his long desired war oh, you got what you want i got what i want you guys figure it out on the field of battle it's not it's not no no care of mine unless it involves protecting my own we've leveled up again wait what's this over here that is the fire that is the corpse i burned now is there anything oh Yeah, but okay there might be an opening there can i go back here and, and is there anything for me to do here life can be really strange is Vernon over here the Guardian, the say Vernon was over here now we make camp with the black ones oh, what's up here by That's the way <laughs> what's it to us what's this okay i'm like please please stop me from doing this game please block me please railroad me yeah i'll take you with though <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am gonna go down this path. It looks cool. Now I think. What? Oh, it's just to get into the mist. I see, and then I turn back. So hell no, it's a shortcut out. And then we're gonna. Oh. Finally, you're back. Okay. Where is Triss? The Nilf Guardians have taken her to Loch Muin. What? They cast a spell on her, turned her into a figurine. Artifact compression. They must have a powerful mage. Not anymore. They had. <laughs> Without him, Shillard won't be able to lift the spell. 
However, Loch Muin will be full of sorcerers. That's not all. They got Triss. Are you telling me you know nothing about this? Hmm, Philippa, Cynthia. come on. She lied to you. Boom. Back to Vergen. At once. Yeah. How do you like that? <laughs> Unless she's lying. Unless she's in all of this. But yeah, that was uh interesting little reveal there in the last codex. Come on, he was just with her just like that. Alright, let's do this again. Let's plow the fields. Damn it. Damn it what? Oh. Jesus. Don't throw around me. Okay, come back when you're ready. Does that free here? I think it does. I think this guy's just a distraction. Wow, this guy's pretty. Th oh, hold on. X. Or not. It's like they they, they uh, sort of remind me of the Inquisition raids, you know. Well, not just raids of demons and stuff. That here, exit, exit, X, X, X. Oh. Okay, that's still cool, but I mean, I just didn't see the animation. I'll get it back. Should I level? And then it's things like this, like I don't even level. Oh, I was talking about how I, I would have prepared before going into the mist, and I would have like racked myself up with um, all the points I needed. Potions. Um, but then because it's going back to the easy point but the, it's like so easy easy is so easy that you don't have to do any of that and even though at the beginning i was sort of like yeah but i don't care i don't want to do it uh, i was saying that i know but in hindsight like if i were to look at this from a more critical perspective i go yeah but now it's like it's removed it all from the game uh, you know what i mean that might have been too much too far left. I think I'm going the right way. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't believe I subconsciously made my way here. The first, I think that for the first time ever, the first shot. All right, well, I should have saved first. I'm gonna save right now, just in case, even though. The plague, I was so foolish. That's probably how I would save Cherish okay. this rare moment, Witcher. Philippa eilhart has been had by a cheap Nilfgaardian bitch. When I find her, we'll have it out like never before. She'll regret her mother didn't abort her. Wait, oh my God. the Rose of Remembrance is gone. Not necessarily. That viper, Cynthia, was in a hurry and left her bric-a-brac. Ah yes, here it is. Triss Merigold's Rose of Remembrance. Time is running out, Geralt. This flower is dying. Then what are we waiting for? No, because I love her. <laughs> so it would die. You can't die. Anyways, um, yeah, so. Interesting, spy. Okay, so let's go back in. Oh, I see. So sometimes you just finish a major quest and bang, you get dropped into a, uh, a two-level uh, spurt. All right. Well, uh, instant kill to five or we start working on uh, counter moves, distance covered while dodging. Oh, damn. Oh, could hmm, that might be interesting. Speed of vigor regen. Oh, shit. I want that. Oh, let's just go straight to it. Let's get some vigor regen. Just again, speed it up. I'm all just about speeding it up at this point, <laughs> because it's not really. I don't need to really think about anything else. Uh, okay, so we can talk ingredients four. Well, let's do one final read round because it looks like we're about to push this to the end of Act Two. Uh, small comfort though it is, Geralt spotted the rose of rumors he gave to Triss among the sundry Cynthia had left behind. Now he could use the flower petals as an ingredient for Sasuke's cure. Uh, this is like narrative mirroring is what I call it. When So that flower scene happens, which I'm glad it did. Uh, in my head, I was like, I hope that comes back at the end of Act 2 because that's an, it's, I call it narrative mirroring, mirroring. And what was said at that moment would have been vital for me to keep in mind because then it would be like, oh, no, because it's, yeah. 
kind of like it strings it together it strings like it's it's done subtly in most stories but it's usually always there in good storytelling and that's subjective of course but this is what i would call very good story structure this game has very good story structure so i'm, I'm i am curious to see how they do the second run of it because i would think that this would still have to be meaningful something with a rose maybe i don't know i don't know i would like it to be otherwise i could lucked out is there anything else I need to do on this map before I click this? Because as far as I can tell, I really don't feel like I have anything else I can do. So I don't want to regret anything either. So that's one final check. The other thing I loved about this run being on easy with the mod for the equipment. <laughs> I haven't had to do equipment management once. That's the perfect amount. <laughs> That's the perfect amount. Um, what was I going to do next? I was going to check uh, quests. Uh, so we have these left. Just, oh. Oh, wait for it. Did I never have to do this? Did not disappoint. He knew a lot. Symbol of hatred. Bearing... Oh, unfortunately, the blade belonged to Saskia. Point, right. So this is all going to trigger. It's going to domino effect. All right. Oh, what's this one? Shit. What is this? <laughs> How come that won't still do something to get out of my lock? Assassin of the Kings, eternal battle. No, that's it. We're good. Let's let's go. Let's go. You wanted to discuss something. Uh, everything's good. Let's Your turn, see. sorceress. I have all you need she's, to cure, She's playing a major game Let's of get to chess, work. though, I still think. Scoyotel, and she's definitely stand aside. deceiving. I call deception. She's like a master deceiver. So, like, I felt like that's how I read this. How, how all this pans out, though. I mean, I think that this is all shenanigans, but she looks legitimately screwed here. So... She can handle it. Jesus, though. <laughs> God damn. damn. I I could. I'll be honest. I could swear she was behind this. So unless it's still shenanigans, with the other stuff being mixed in. Or I think it's maybe it's like all the mages are around. Oh, they have this uh, the huge game of chess going on. That was my favorite type of magic, <laughs> lesbomancy. Dwarves. What is your name? Sen, sen, sen. What do they call you? Saskia. Do you remember what happened? <laughs> Poison. They poisoned me. What day is it? What of the battle? Henselt and his army. Calm yourself. You will have your battle yet. Mm. I shall go and announce that you are once again among the living. Do I owe you my life? And Philippa. Thank you, Geralt. Mm. I promise to return we'll say, maybe, the favor. Maybe. I don't know. Anymore. Have you succeeded maybe, in lifting the curse? No, but we're almost ready to try. Vandergrift's sword. It's one of the conveyors of the power. You should have taken it. It's scrap iron to me, a sword like any other. The Scoyatel wouldn't let anyone but Philippa near you, mm. and they wouldn't have let even her take your famous sword. I'll try to remove the curse soon. Why do you aid me? Hmm. Um. Why the uh? Well, I mean, I need Triss. <laughs> I want Triss back. I don't care about these things. I, this is a cool one. Uh, but it's more like I know I had stuff in my head. I'm like, would Geralt have pieced some stuff together? Maybe the stuff I'm thinking. I'm like, Geralt. I think my Geralt would have picked up on something strange. Oh, no, because he wasn't up there. So it is meta. 
because the piece I have in my head was when the prince and her were talking to Hanselt. And then the way that exchange happened, there was one particular moment where I was like, mm -mm, that's, there's something there, something more there. And then I was like, it, it might be that she's this thing. And it's partial shenanigans. And it's just me trying to stitch together the shenanigans. But now it's like, mm, she does speak like she's, she believes these things. I don't think that's an act. So then that leads me to lead, to believe that, I mean, we, we have uh, evidence that uh, there's mage things all over the place. There's like sh shenanigans at the very high level from the mage council perspective. And now we have spy. Now, I mean, it could be that Philip is all of this is an act, even that Cynthia was there, like she knew Cynthia was planted and she was doing a double, double, double cross. Like she was not double, double, that didn't make sense. You know, she knew. And so she was taking advantage of it as well, or they were all in on it. And it's like a it's like a high level council um, play across all of the lands and, and uh, manipulation of all of the courts and stuff so that they can bring um, a series of events together to then uh, kind of play a trump card. That's but how does that. Hmm. I don't know. I'm gonna leave it at that. So where so where does that leave me? So lifting curves in my profession. Yeah. Is he getting paid? Not really. So I'm going to go with Triss, like to say whatever's I'm doing behind it for this. You for a cause, but the truth is far less lofty. A certain so elf what, mem my memory. I'd recover my memory oh. during this battle. Yeah. I had no idea Thank you God. believed Just in prophecies. Line it up. I don't, but I also don't have a choice. I need to try. If my amnesia was magically induced, the elf's Jennifer, prophecy is just memory, common sense. Triss. When I lift the curse, a memory. shockwave will roll across the battlefield. A wave of pure, uncontrolled power looking for an outlet. As soon as it finds one, hmm. a strong field of anti-magic will arise. Who knows what might happen Did to someone subjected to these extreme conditions. Did she just nod as if he's making sense? But something's <laughs> just... gotta give. I'm oh. fresh out of alternatives. Good luck, Witcher. We await your return. Also, the other piece, I, I will honestly, I, I, a part of me is like, it feels like um marigold is not a part of all of these shenanigans like she's maybe a loose cannon to the mages or maybe maybe they're all in on uh controlling her somehow or like i don't know there's that that piece of uh everything is sort of um yeah i'm not 100 percent sure because at one point i was like maybe she's like in on things or maybe she was but then she kind of came to she's like no this is I'm not going to go through with this anymore. I don't know. So I'm trying to piece that together. I'm reaching I'm act three, which is why I'm saying a little bit more, because like this means I'm about to ramp through the game. And so there's very little, I think, that can spoil me. What the? By the time I'm ready to go. Did I ever? Well, i got to resituate myself because I'm... Uh... Okay, no, I know where I am. <laughs> I got distracted. I'm confused there. Oh, okay then. Um, let's go here. Life and death. Uh, do, do, do. So ask, da, da, da. Uh, and when the witcher gathered all the ingredients, he headed for Philippa's house with them. Okay, that's done. Hatred symbolized. Hatred Dragon Slater had no objections and handed the witcher Vanagriff's sword while expressing her gratitude. Our hero acquired the symbol of hatred. Okay, so this is big one, big arcing one, big arcing one. This one that's just hanging. Uh, I don't know. Maybe the inn has. I don't. I don't even know where to go with this. Black and blue ruining his plans for eternal glory. The nice curses follow Geralt. Maybe he does. Maybe something triggers. And then oh, talk to Philippa. Okay, let's talk to Philippa again then. Yep. Good. Good. Man, this is. I mean, when I say moving along, this is moving along. All in one episode. All of this just culminating. It's like a boulder. You wanted to discuss something. Okay, well, uh, am I pushing too fast? Like, hold on. Should I go to the inn first? I might be missing, like, lore and banter. It's probably going to be insignificant. Oh, let me just save here so I can teleport back if <laughs> this is useless. I'm going to go to the inn. I'll catch you there. Let's talk to the companions. Oh my god, I just realized I'm only carrying one sword on my back. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Easy mode. <laughs> Son of a bitch. The thing is, like, are my swords still on me or did I lose them when I did that one thing? Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> That's funny. Ooh. 
Ma, I guess I'm using this one. Weird. All right. Well, it's, it's good. It's got a lot of great stuff, but I got to shack it up now. <laughs> so let's go to enhancements. What are we going to do here? We're going to go uh, armor runes. What's this one again? Bleeding. Uh, sun. Damage. I think damage is just solid. Just to be done with it. Put another fire rune in there. It's damage plus five and it gets the other things. Shit, I might have messed it up a little bit. Oh, it's okay. Incinerate. I use the Yeah, let's put that on there. I don't know. I don't know if you can redo this after, but. Uh, and let's go with. Uh, let's go with vitality. Fire again? I could just do fire again. I don't know if they stack. It would suck if they don't stack. Because I'm going to do it. It's done. Uh, hold on then. And then the harpy. Because are you saying that... Because if the harpy has... Yeah, three slots. <laughs> oh, it's damaged the heart. Well... I still get the 12%. I do the three extra damage, but then I could put three runes on it. I lose the adrenaline, but who cares? Right? So, I mean, good against harpies, which we're not going to buy anymore, let's be honest. But it's just bonus. It's at this point, it's not, it's not necessary. Here, let's put it in. And because I want to just waste some more runes, just because uh, we can. And it looks like we're about to push through the game really fast at this point. So, let's go with fire. Yes. Fire again, please. Where is it? Right there. Do that again. And then maybe... Ooh, damage plus seven. They're bleeding. Damage. There. <laughs> Perfect. By the way. Um, no, nah, I don't need that. Uh, this... Okay, armor. Let me do an armor check here. I haven't even cleaned out my gear. It's okay. <laughs> we got a fort. Let's see. Resistances. I just want to see what I look like. Yeah, I'm going to switch this out. Hold on. Uh, Hunter's armor. Here, let's switch this out. I want to see what it looks like. Damn. That looks good. Because it's such... It's, it's great design, but then they don't really give you a reason to like really switch out your armor. You, I made that one thing at the beginning-ish of this game. I was here when I made it. No, it was in the Act 1 still. I don't know. But I feel like it's just... I never had to redo it. It's crazy. Uh, yeah, these jack boots are good, so that actually paid, paid itself off. Uh, armor of Loch Muin. Oh, wow. <laughs> Holy shit. Hold on a second. Trousers. Uh, 666. 878. Uh, Nilf Guardian boots. Uh, four here and a 2 2 armor. Wow. Okay, Nilf Guardian boots. Let's put those on instead. So, jack boots aren't better. Okay, and then the armor. I guess let's see this armor on now. Ooh, that's pretty red. I like it. So if it's better, I'll take it. Okay, eight. I mean, this definitely looks better. That's crazy. Ooh, and I got three slots. Damn. Okay. Armor of Bernard. Let's see what that looks like. Armor of Bernard. Yeah, I'm playing dress up right now. I like the tones of this one. I do like red quite a bit though. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Uh, I know you could buy a bunch of these and I can't really redo these. This one's good though, plus two and my here, plus two magical, boom. That takes it to 20 now. And I can take it up another one. I can take it all the way up. Just vitality and armor, yeah, down with it. Here, let's just stack this up. Whoa, whoa just make, make sure it can stack. Okay, good, it does stack. and. There, 30 vitality plus six armor. Done. <laughs> Done. Uh, let's check trof trophies. Anything? Whoa. What's the wraith one give you? Damage six. Armor. Armor to damage. Mm. I don't know. That's that thing. Uh, Vitsa, okay. Akira, Necker, and Draga. Okay. Well, the wraith one is decent, but. Armor 4. Nah, armor 4. Okay, I think I'm done. Save. Yeah, just switch it up a little bit. There we go. And, I mean, and it's better, but... 
Okay, catch it. Missed. What detour there? Let's go back in here and see what's up. Take part in the ghostly battle within the mist. Jeez. Let's find out some memory stuff, shall we? Am I gonna break the game if I keep doing this? Okay. Whoa! I'm like in in the battle. Love the autumn. I got the fruit is plentiful. You won't be the ones picking it. You'll be picking enemy heads today. No reason to wait. Slaughter the cat when he must. Wait. Time's not right. Sometimes I forget what we're fighting for. Our uh -huh. old kings have no choice but to wage war. Then why don't them avenge and hensel duels to settle things? My brother-in-law is from Kedwin, a decent fellow. Once I was at a market there. Quality goods cheaper than our merchants. What's going on right now? Bloody hell! Shut it! <laughs> Every Kedwin is a bastard. You know what okay, because comment on all generalization and fantasy. They come to pillage, burn, and steal our well, land. And we should give it away. Fair. Horse and seed. Uh, modern times no. and be fair. Wait for the signal. There's no time to lose. Silence. Enter zombie Archers. Geralt. Light your arrows. Aim at the first ditch. Get them. Catch on the enemy standard! Oh. That's awesome. What am I doing right now though? Am I just uh am I for am I uh am I a dude? And then what? Can I uh battle? Defeat? Can I pull out a sword at least? There you go. What do I do? Do I oh, so I take this KO? Okay. Oh man, I got myself all armored up so that I could uh do some cray cray stuff. Can I dodge? Can I dodge? Wait, can I? Oh, I can't dodge even. I can just swing. So this is like... Okay. So that just removes all tactics from it anyways, even if you're playing on a harder difficulty maybe? I don't know. That was quick. Oh! Oh, every time I... Standards in enemy hands. We're sitting oh, I'm chomping bodies. You need to tell the commander we were ambushed. We can't hold without reinforcements. Till they get further down the line. I'm to tell him. No, Princess Syphilis. Move it, imbecile, before they slaughter us to a man. I shall make it. First battle. Killed my first man. Got blood on my hands. You got this, man. I got you under control. Ow, 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 ow. Was that him? Oh. Oh. Take cover! They're shooting! Who's shooting? Behind us? I'm going this way. <laughs> oh. I'm guessing easy mode gives you what? It either gives you some freebies or it doesn't matter? Or what? I don't see them landing though. Are they landing behind me? I'm just gonna give her. Go by the sounds. Oh, it's the horns. Yes. He's one of ours. Oh, sweet. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh my god, that's so neat. <laughs> My lord, the leader of the Dun Banner sent me. We were ambushed. We can't hold. Weren't your scouts keenly watching the battlefield, so Captain? awesome. Yes, sir. They must have dug those ditches in the night. The field was clear by day. Lady Glephysic scanned it with her magic during the night. Ten lashes to each scout. Hang every third one. My lord, we need support. There will be no reinforcements. You must hold. And you, clever sick. I'll settle this after the battle. The king will learn of your incompetence. Battles are won right, or lost gets, by the commanders, not by sorceresses. Out. Remember, I'll make a report too. And. I finished talking to you, witch. Time to win this battle! Oh my god, my this thing is so cool. To your battles! There's a bunch of shields and shit. 
Yes. Oh, oh my god, I don't know how you made that sword, but okay. We enter the fray! It looks like it was just heated. Let's just melt it yourself. Damn. Maybe you finished with me. But that doesn't mean I finished with you. Why do you get to look all normal when everything else is a Nadovesavek. This is not what I anticipated. I'll give that to you. I thought I thought it was gonna be a Dragon Breath shenanigans. That's what I thought. The whole rain of fire thing, immune to the flames from the. Nope. Uh, if I'm seeing this correctly, and this is truth, I'm pretty sure she's gonna meteor shower the. Oh. How can we help you, Sabrina? My place at Hensel's court is threatened. Furthermore, if Vandergrift wins the battle, nothing will stop Hensel from Council taking Council shenanigans. The balance of power in the north will be upset. What do you intend? I shall summon Melgar's fire to the battlefield. Hair cutter chick is here. <laughs> Any use of unconventional weapons may be severely censored. I'm aware of that. Oh, maybe it's just a model. No, it's just a model. Okay. Uh huh. We will help you, but remember, in the event that you fail, you'll be on your own. That's what I'm saying. Ready. Like you can't. She, she like there's a big, big game, big, big play happening, and it looks like Philippa's at the top of just the entire, the entire big play for the council. Is it called the Council of Mages? I feel like that's like a dragon thing. It's not right. I don't know. Is there a Kenwenny to match? Selkirk of Gallant on this field. Yes. That's, just, that's kind of fun. A very, very. It's a creative way of having pulled this off. I'll give it that. Now, granted, without having more tactics than just swinging a blade, eh. They maybe minimized the coolness of this. Because. But it still is because it's like you're still cutting, like you're playing out the story of this, and you get to kind of see this perspective, find out how all the stuff went down. So, so Geralt proper is taking in those. It's not just story; it's not hearsay. It's like he's seeing it, so he's seeing the truth, so he can make decisions based. Like, because I can't like you know, I, I can't. Do well, I guess they get stuck and I go behind them like that, but it's just weird. So you can't roll or do the do the roll. Oh shit! Was that her then, or? Oh, that opened up this thing. Okay. What's, What's up? Again, just be cool. just be tactically cool. Outside of easy, if there was more, I could. Oh. I'm thinking as if I was going to be hard. I belong away in this meeting. Leave, ghost. Okay, I now you're a girl fighting the fight. That would be cool. Grift. He will kill Please, you. Just do it that way. Selkirk does not fear death. Interesting. When you die, your soldiers will die every day afterwards. Forever. Leave. This is a task for a witcher, not a knight. I do this solely for my men. It's so it's so cool the way this lore does this shit. Um, can I fight you? Are we defeat the Kaywani army general? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. And then if this was on normal or hard, this would be like a killer fight, and that would be worth it. Come on! No, not come on. We're fine. Okay, let's just uh, back up a little bit. Might as well do something here, something else here, just because we never do it. Does that do anything? Because he's got armor, so like, why would that even bother him? Oh, there we go. Right? You don't care. Mercy. Look at these designs, though. It's so cool. So part of the write-up is that like armor and web, like all of it, kind of comes together to like form around these Who things, right? They're not just, not just bodies, but... Your nightmare. The Wicca Man. That's not a Wicca Man. <laughs> it's a... 
Fucking hell. Holy shit, this would have been awesome. Okay. I'm going to <laughs> RP trap it. My bad. Alright, let's see what this does. Whoa! Whoa! Ow! Ow! ow. Jesus! Archers! I don't know what I'm doing there. Whoa. Can I not? Oh shit. Okay, this would have been crazy. Am I actually doing something here to you? I mean, I'm not. Oh, there we go. I see the health going down. There we go. I'm not getting my st my other stuff going off though. Uh, you got me cornered. You're gonna like sweep kick me. Hold on. There we go. Okay, done. Get you to core. I'll sweep kick you. Oh shit, that's bad. That's no, fine. It's fine. Fireball in the face. When in doubt, fireball. Achievement, fat man. I don't know why that was called fat man. Okay. First mages. To die after such People a victory! Seen. Gods, we can't fight such sorcery! The sorcerers hail unclean fire. We're doomed! Why are they doing this? As the prophecy saith, and the time will come when sorceresses turn on men. Flaming balls rain from the sky, and destruction will be unleashed. What should we do? Wait here for death! I shall lead you as a shepherd leads his flock. Safely from the dark abyss. Hmm. Oh, holy shit! Still going. Okay, time to lead the men. Uh, this way. Pretty sure. Let's just pick a direction. Should I be like hiding behind these things while we go or what? Am I just running? Oh, I think someone bit it. Someone bit it. Everyone good? Oh I see the lighting on the on the ground is where they're gonna land. Oh the banner. Make a run for it! Save us, sire! Sabrina, is that your work? Order your troops forward, your majesty. The Adernian army is rooted. Not only the Adernian. Look at that terrified horde. This very morning, they were the finest of my knights. They'll make it if they're reinforced. Mm -hmm. Who allowed you to use magic? Sire, if you strike now, Lawmark will be yours. You've tainted my honor. Brought death to dozens of knights. Sire, the battle was lost. You put me to shame before them of end. Oh, His yeah. troops fought like men of honor should. Uh, with honor, you know? Sabrina Grevesig, I sentence you to death. You shall burn at the stake. I will return to claim my birthright. And I guess you just accept it because that was the agreement. July 25th, 1270. The forests of Angren. Hmm. No mighty mortal, no heap of meat or strong man can parry the strike of the slizzard's tail. Letho couldn't either, but by some miracle he survived. I helped him. After all, witchers on the path should help. Oh, there's a memory. Had oh. two comrades, brother witchers oh. from the school of the Viper. The hunt continued south, and Letho of Gullet knew where it was going. He knew where the hellish chase would end. Was this a novel or a story, maybe, or...? What? <laughs> like, hmm. No. Did my graphics go glitchy or were your eyes? Oh. You're finally awake. Your eyes are messed up, dude. Am I dead or there we hallucinating? Go. You wouldn't meet me in the beyond. I don't remember coming here. Because you didn't. Don't forget, we sorceresses have our ways. In that case, thanks for your help. You're too valuable to let die. 
You did the mm, impossible. Just a pawn, I think. I don't know anyone who could deal with such a powerful curse. It's a long, it's a long tail play here. <laughs> you never said I'd face certain death. I never stopped believing in you. Now, tell me everything that happened. Nip is everyone. Oh, nice. Huh. I can not say what I saw. No, I think Geralt was just, he just, he just says things straight on. I mean, he's lied a couple times in this game, but I don't know, my Geralt in my head, I'm like, no, he'll just say things because he doesn't, he just accepts things and then deals with them. That's, that's what I. I, I saw Henselt sentencing Sabrina to death. I tell her. I killed the drog. You must have. Since the curse has gone. I mean, he wouldn't have seen the council gathering I or saw whatever they're called. I saw a rain of fireballs and death all around the me. aftermath. Everywhere. That part's meta. Henselt is a criminal. He used the circumstances to kill Sabrina. He hated her. Hmm. That's why you sided with Edern. For vengeance? It's not about vengeance. It's about a better world. A world without Henselts. That's hmm. utopia. Passing through such a concentrated mass of the power opens the mind. Hmm. Cedric was right. The power of the Wraith's battle restores memory. And what have you recalled? Letho, Voltest's murderer. I saved him once and he helped me find the wild hunt. I just don't know if we managed to save Yennefer. Did you learn well, anything he said else about the hunt? He was... didn't, didn't when I killed that? the king of the hunt, I killed a wraith. In my memories, I fight the hunt's riders. Blood flows from their wounds and they cry out in pain. Which means you do not yet know all. Not to worry. I will. You lifted the curse, but there's no time to rest. Henselt's army will attack at any moment. Um, How's Saskia, Saskia feeling? Completely recovered. She can't mm. wait to deal with Henselt. She will personally command the defense of Vergen. She's in her element. A siege can't be her element if she never faced one. You underestimate her. Keep in mind she's got allies. A famous witcher and me. Perhaps I helped Henselt and put Edern in danger by lifting the curse, but I had no other choice. Sometimes you need to amputate the leg to save the body. Time to decide the outcome of this war. High time. Zoltan and Yarpen are setting up the troops. They're waiting for you. Wow. Talk to Zoltan. So, are we doing Dragon Age style? Dragon Age Origin style? What's up? Let okay. us kneel and pray for a favorable day. Gods, grant us strength oh, and protect us in up, battle. Uh... We ask oh, not for oh, victory. For we shall win regardless. All right, it's going to be a Dragon Age style uh, onslaught here. Oh, blocking. Okay, railroading. Good, good. And I think with that, I'm going to wrap up this episode because we are. That's it. Can't go that way either. You're you're going straight. Look at this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Neat. Move those feet. This is the army I like how they guided the you. The just, this, this is it. This now. is the part of the quest. Just go and do it, you know? So, uh, I, I, I should stop here. Something's going to trigger. You'll Something's going to trigger. We're going to stop right here. Okay. Okay. Shh, wait. Yes, we bloody do. It's a dwarven fortress. They'll break their teeth here. I hope you're right. But the walls aren't That's Sebastian's voice. Were. I swear it. The walls will hold. Even if they don't, Saskia will come up with something. Not this guy. She knows what she's doing. All right. I will continue this in the next episode. Don't forget to explore. Engage. And inspire everybody. Peace.